Hello everyone and today is my third exam of science and today I'm going to show you how I do my exam of science so let's get started. So first of all we have objective type and our question one question number one of objective type is encircle the correct answer. Number one ozone layer protects us from ghosts, aliens, UVAs or sunlight, UV rays. Carbon dioxide is used by humans inhaling, by plants to exhale, by plants to make food, to order, produce orange glowing bulb. It is by plants to make food. Isis and Decro bar are examples of inclined plane, screw, or liver. It is liver. Two heavy objects can be two heavy objects can be joined together tightly with the help of inclined plane, screw, liver, or pulley. It is screw sound can travel fastest in air water sea it is air which of these sounds have high pitch and high frequencies the rumbling of thunder the chirping of birds the scream of a baby the screeching of brakes the scream of a baby the unit of energy is joule newton kilogram it is joule different opposition causes kinetic potential or mechanical energy it is kinetic energy more vibrations per second produce noise, high sound silence. They produce noise. Oxygen is bad for humans, food and packing, fire, none of these. It is food and packing. Next we have question number two, label the sound wave. So here we have a sound wave. First of all, we have to label what is this. It is the crest. Then... We have to tell what is this part. It is the trough. Then we have to label this part. It is the amplitude. Then our question, question number 2B is complete the uh, table keeping composition of air in mind. So first of all, we have nitrogen, percentage, uh, name of gas, percentage in air, nitrogen. Nitrogen 78.08%, oxygen 20.94%, 20 carbon dioxide 0.03%, other gases 0.95%, water vapor is variable. Next, we have a question Who was this scientist? This scientist is Sir Isaac Newton. Next, we have question number 3B label the types of machines in each box so here we have written it first first the first one is inclined plane the second one is also inclined plane the third one is wheel and axle the fourth one is also wheel and axle uh, the fifth one is wedge, the sixth one is wedge, the seventh one is screw, the eighth one is screw, the nine one is liver, the ten one is liver, the eleven one is pulley, the twelve one is pulley. <coughs> Next, we are going to uh, question number four fill in the boxes with the words shooting an arrow, potential energy, kinetic energy. First, we have potential energy, then shooting an arrow, then kinetic energy. Uh, then we have question number five find out uses of the following energies and write them in the space provided heat cooking drying of clothes keeping us warm light we can't see without light plants need light to make food kinetic it helps to move objects in windmill this energy is used to produce electricity next um, we have um, mechanical energy so and mechanical energy we have running motor vehicles water flowing in water flowing in a stream so next we have uh, the objective type uh, subjective type sorry answer any five questions so we have the question number one what is the atmosphere and atmospheric layers atmosphere the earth is surrounded atmosphere the earth is surrounded by a layer of gases is called atmosphere the atmosphere on earth is really important for the existence of light because it contains important gases it controls weather 
it protects us from uv rays next we have layers of atmosphere number one troposphere it extends to 12 kilometer above the surface next we have the stratosphere it extends to 12 to 50 kilometer above the surface ozone layer is present in it next we have next we have mesosphere it extends to 80 kilometer above the surface meteors are falling in it next we have Next we have thermosphere. It extends to 320 km above the surface. Satellites are present in it. Next we have exosphere. It extends beyond thermosphere to infinity. Next we have question number two. Question number two is what do you know about harmful gases? So some gases that are harmful in large quantities are called harmful gases. Example, carbon dioxide CO2, carbon monoxide CO, sulfur dioxide SO2. So next we have explanation. Number one, carbon dioxide is harmful in large quantity as CO2 quantity increase in atmosphere global warming is caused co2 trap heat next we have uh, next we have sulfur dioxide carbon dioxide and smoke i emit from chimney exhaust from engines are really harmful even in small quantity next we have question number three what are the types of forces there are six types of forces Number one, friction. Number two, buoyancy. Number three, air resistance. Number four, gravity. Number five, pressure. Number six, balanced force. Next, we have question number four. What is the difference between wheel and axle? Wheel and axle are two wheels and a ball join them. It is a type of simple machine. Example, car, bike, and truck wheels. Next, we have pulley. In pulley, we have pulley is used to pull a load. It is also a type of simple machine. Example, curtain, well, and cranes. Next, we have answer number seven. Name and define. Name and define five different types of energy. Potential energy. Number one, potential energy. It is the energy in matter due to its position or arrangements of its parts for example water in dams has potential energy next we have kinetic energy it is the energy of a moving object for example running through water and zebra moving air chemical energy chemical energy it refers to the energy released by chemical reaction in the food we eat contain chemical energy Next, we have electrical energy. It comes from the electrons within an atom. It can be generated at a power plant or inside a battery. Next, we have the fifth type of energy that is nuclear energy. Energy contained in the nucleus of an atom. It is released when nuclei nuclei are split into several pieces so now i have done my final exam of science i hope you like my video don't forget to like and share subscribe to my channel and click the and press the bell icon to get notifications of my new video